All right, so we're going to continue Whole Foods to the Puerto Rican who has the nerve to work at the 57th Street Whole Foods still. Who has received, they have, who, anyway, the, the first one I spoke about, the little one actually the part, they have, have 77 complaints about him already. And 27 complaints about that day about me and 77 complaints to human resources and to management about him. And he still, he still works there. Anyway, to the Puerto Rican who has the nerve to work at the 57th Street Whole Foods who thinks his shit don't sink. His faggot ass thinks he's better than me. Born in September 7, 1984 in Arecibo, Puerto Rico. Came to New York City in 1997. Dropped out of his freshman year of high school. Resident of 171 Vice Avenue, apartment 6, 6D. Son of Diana Reyes Lopez and Diego Benitez Rodriguez. His name is Leydon. L-A-E-D-O-N ben, um, Benitez. He thinks he's special because his name is Leydon. 87.9% of the customers of the Whole, Food, Whole Foods market on 50 Cent hates him. I paid there 97% of the time. I had seven receipts of paid foods from that location the day. It was Puerto Rican day, the day of the Puerto Rican day prayer. I didn't pay that day. And he chased me out of Whole Foods. I came back to eat three months and two weeks and one day later, and he was still there. I was preparing my plate with a, a, um, a, a, a piece of salmon. There were only two left. He told me that the manager of that Whole Foods did not, uh, did not want me there and I had to leave. The, the manager requested me to leave that Whole Foods. I was a paying customer that day. Anytime you have an incident you cannot, and they took something, whatever, the next time it's a whole different shopping experience. Because sometimes the customer that doesn't buy that stole something that day is going to buy. Trader Joe's has that rule too. And then they come and they always buy something. Trust me, uh, it, it comes out you win more than the, what they took from the floor. The manager at Linden, at Lincoln Center, at Whole Foods, is a coward piece of shit. You are terminated with no employment. Anthony Dawson from 1417 Bryant Avenue. That's disrespect for you. I, we own 72.5% of Bryant Avenue. You are terminated. You get to pay $175,000 a year. So the assistant manager at Columbian Circle Whole Foods, Andrew Landon, resident of Decal, originally from 1175 Vice Avenue, apartment 5A, when you left 17 years ago, and my great grand, my, I mean my grandfather owns that building, and your mom was late seven months of rent, apartment 7B, and we never evicted you and your mom. And we never took you to housing court, and we never charged you for those seven months, and your mother never had to pay for those seven months. You were terminated as well with no unemployment, no um, uh, eligibility for unemployment benefits, and you are making $127,000 a year. To Dion Larden, you are terminated with no unemployment as well. All these men are born in Kingston, Jamaica. Hiring manager, human resources located in Union Square, 14th Street. The hiring manager, Alana Rowland, 27, black female, born in Kingston, Jamaica. Lives in DeKalb, Brooklyn, no college degree, only high school degree. Makes $175,000 a year. Whole Foods is getting too dark for me. And they're disrespectful. Every single owner, not only me. You have not fired anyone. You're a racist bitch. No unemployment for you either. She's been at Whole Foods for seven years. You're terminated with no unemployment benefits at all. To the human resources assistant, Allen. Land, Landon, 37 black male, born in Kingston, Jamaica, came here at 17 years old, never graduated high school, no GED, has been working at Whole Foods for seven years, makes $145,000 a year, resident of the Fordham Road section of the Bronx. You are terminated as well today and do not qualify for unemployment benefits. Layden Benitez, you are terminated and you are not allowed back at the Whole Foods and does not qualify for unemployment. I said, oh, you will get a restraining order today. Racism is not racism and prejudice and effacement and, and fascism is not allowed, it's not tolerated to allowed in any of my companies. Arden Dion, born in Arden Dion, Dion, born in Kingston, Jamaica, no high school diploma. You are terminated from Whole Foods Market today and not qualify for unemployment. The manager of 57 so you have 27 27 um, customer complaints about Layden and still and my situation and he still works there plus an additional 57 complaints about him you make $127,000 a year you're terminated Dion Lard you are terminated from your employment at Whole Foods you do not qualify for unemployment benefits born in Jamaica too assistant manager from 57th Street in Whole Foods 27 year old black male named Alan Lard Laren LAR born in Kingston Jamaica makes $127,500 a year in Whole Foods Came to America at age 22, no high school diploma or GED. You are terminated from your post today. You do not qualify for unemployment benefits. And Evelyn, 
I never made over forty-two thousand dollars a year. These people make a lot of money. Look, no high school diploma. I went to Ford and Prep. My they it was forty-seven thousand five hundred a year. I went to Harvard, two hundred thirty-seven thousand a year. University of Oxford, two hundred seventy-two thousand for a master's and PhD in Princeton is four hundred seventy-five thousand dollars. And I, the most I ever made, because Evelyn, it's, it's thirty-two thousand five hundred dollars a year to Julie Gardner. Tony never had to do nothing with a salary I made. He gave excellent references. Julie Gardner fucked me over everything for me. He gave me, Tony gave me a total of $12,750 in four, in four years. Evelyn gave me only $3,750 in 36 years. And he gave me, that total him, $3,427 a year. He was sending me $50 a day when I was away and became my homeless. And I was back out of his apartment and through my celly. Through my, and then she said I was a drug addict and permanently deleted my celly from Bank of America. And then I want to create a, the, um, a promotional ladder is going to be called. Each of our promotional ladder is manageable because we have uh, many um, businesses in the Trump organization and many lower businesses from fast food and, and, and small stores and everything. I want to create a promotional ladder in age, which it means for people who have experience and have proven a track, good track record from a lower tier of management to a higher tier of management will be higher from the bottom up. So managers probably that work at Starbucks who make $75,000 a year, we go upgrade into a $125,000, $50,000 manager position at Whole Foods. You get what I'm saying because they did a great job and they work so much at, 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 at raising canes at Whole Foods at Chipotle at Chick-fil-A at McDonald's so you have the opportunity to make up to 250 300 thousand dollars a year starting from the bottom even if you lack a, a master's or, or, and, or business management or, or a bachelor's in business management but you started from the bottom and you have proven that you know how you're, you had great interpersonal skills you're great at directing you're great at, 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 at many things at many facets in the business you know and you have good traits. All right. So a little Puerto Rican bitch that he thinks he's cute. He knows I don't pay pay at Columbus Circle. He was pestered and judged me that my choice of drink was a four dollar seventy five cent passion fruit juice, which only that Whole Foods sells. He thought that 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 was overdoing it. Alex Lopez Diaz, born in Boca on Puerto Rico. He's a crazy controlling bitch. Resident of one hundred and seventeenth Phil Street. Phil S. Phil Street at apartment two D. The building my grandfather, the King of Spain, owns. Your parents, Alana Diaz Aviles from Boquerón, Puerto Rico, and Lado Lopez Castro, born in Boquerón, they have not paid rent for two months already. Last time, y'all didn't pay rent for seven months in 2012, and we forgave it, and you didn't have to pay back. Alex, you are terminated from Whole Foods today, and if you come back, you're going to get a restraining order and arrested, and your family has 60 days to be removed from the apartment on Phil Street. Failure, and then it's going to be failure to pay nine months, including your seven months owned in 2012 arrears, only late payments of $10,500 owned. We are filing eviction in the next seven days. Whole Foods and Brian, Whole Foods and Brian Park, the walkie talkie got security guard from downstairs. The fat Albert with glasses, Eric Landon, born in Kingston, Jamaica, age 47, 272 pounds, security guard, born in Kingston. You are terminated and do not qualify for unemployment. Working two years, one day, 72 complaints were received about him, and he is not terminated.